All right, well, today I'm doing something a little different. Um, I had a viewer comment say that he had a slasher two getting up into the 2200 millimeters a second. Um, that is extremely fast. Now, if you see on our slasher, um, the slasher, of course, gives a roll bonus of negative 80%, web of fire, disruptor, after bonus of 10% per level, and frigate command per level, you get uh, cannon tracking speed and additional cannon damage. Um, I wanted to see if I can fit uh, missile launchers on a slasher 2 and retain um, some decent DPS along with going uh, 2200 meters a second. With the cannons, I don't think um, the velocity really, the extra velocity um, is going to help because these guys are extremely short range. 1.2 kilometers and accuracy fall off is five um, Pretty much if anybody webs you you lose all of that additional velocity um, So what I tried to do is stick some mark 7 small missile launchers on there um, a web of fire to slow them down uh, If I get within uh, 12 kilometers of them, I can web them and they can't web me um my damage is taking a pretty big toll on my Condor. I hit about 11, 1200 a volley with this guy. I hit about 500. Um, I was seeing if the speed would uh, allow me to tank longer potentially and the damage per second doesn't really matter in terms if I'm not getting hit as much. It just takes longer to kill people. Um, but yeah, I'm going to try slotting some uh, small auto cannons on here and I'm going to see if somebody can web me while I'm doing a very tight radius around them and see if uh, I can still retain my not getting hit vibe here. My mechanical rigs, I'm going to stick these on just for the video. We got flight velocity and inertia modifier so I can potentially orbit in a very tight and fast range. I'm going to pull my interruptive warp disruptor off my other guy here and uh, just go PKing with the auto cannons for a bit. Um, I do not have barely anything in auto cannons. Yeah, I put three points in here just for the video. If you guys were, were doing PKing with the Slasher, I'd recommend all the way up to Advanced or even Expert. You really want to just max out the damage per second. It's uh, pretty low. Um, yeah, we'll uh, take it for a spin. So I've got a Slasher 2 following me around here. Just see if he does anything. <clears throat> Looks like this slasher two is trying to take me out. Oh boy, I got a Condor 2 on me now. And they're out of here. Well, I just fought off another Slasher 2 with small missile launchers. 
and I'm going to complete the anomaly. Now we are missing out about um, just about 500 damage per tick, but we are going extremely faster than I'd say uh, in the Condor. Um, yeah, we're going about 2,000 meters a second. I've heard some people getting up to 2,200. I don't have my uh, my uh, afterburner quite maxed yet. You can see I have uh, five and four. Um, eventually, I'm going to get this to five so I can put some more into this at um, rank four there, which is a pretty big jump. Um, it's an extra 8% velocity. Um, I do have a couple rigs, um, which I'll probably insert uh, prior to showing this clip. Um, and we'll see how fast we can get. Oops. But we are just flying around here. These small missile launchers are 22 kilometer range, so that feels pretty comfortable. I'm not really getting hit by anything other than when I AFK out there. Um, but yeah. And dirty, there's people just warping in left to right. Let's see if we can take out this Tawar trainer. Let's orbit him slightly closer at the 19. This place is filled with people. Uh, that tower is not doing barely any damage. I'll just get my shields nice and full. I should have brought my warp disruptor, but uh, it's still on my other ship. Yeah, this guy's going to have to warp out any second. Let's go a little closer. Let's go to 11 there. Get our interruptive warp disruptor, or interruptive uh, stasis webifier. And this guy's got to warp out soon. Yep, there he goes. And well, just got a shout out from uh, Ren eight ninety nine there. Baked? Hey, I watched your videos. That was pretty cool. Uh, you'll be in my next video, my friend. Alright, let's just engage our afterburner here. Let's just see how easily we can take this out. Um, just a tier 4. Nothing special, don't have the best gear on. But like me, I'm specced with missiles. Um, I have barely any points in cannon, which is the specialty for the ship. I did buy um, some cannons I'm going to try out just for heaven's sake to see how, uh, how uh, well I can switch up the weapons. Um, we'll see if they do any damage. They're pretty short range, but um, yeah, we'll see what happens. All right, so once again, I found some debris outside of a warp gate. Let's see if we can get it here. Eggs. Let's get it before the cyclone does. Nothing good on them. Well, not lucky this time, boys. Alright, so I did something slightly different here. I noticed that these auto cannons have a uh, four second activation time. I have no shield booster, but 
Um, this guy is going to substantially speed up my uh, shots here. So I'm going to see if I can intentionally get webbed. Let's set it to three like it says. Let's see how much damage we take when we get webbed and we're just loading our... Uh, our auto cannons off here, celestial body. So we are webbed. Okay. Oop, I should probably we are taking some damage. So if you see here these I can't seem to orbit in a tight enough range, so just set it to one. We're shooting pretty fast, but not for much damage. If I were to be doing this up close like this, I would want torpedoes on my Condor. Seems to take out T4s just fine. Um, let's orbit this guy at three. So I am still taking some damage here. So we are going 1100 meters a second and slowing down slightly on the turns. It's kind of having some trouble orbiting this guy here and actually uh, tracking him. And that's probably due to my lack of cannon skills. Um, so I don't think this is the best uh, frigate type for solo PvP. Um, to be honest, I'd rather have my missiles that aren't specced for this ship than these uh, auto cannons here. Just the second you get webbed, you're just completely boned. We're definitely able to tank out the hits we do get, um, but if you see, if you go outside the five or six range, it's just almost doing no damage. 74. Yeah, the DPS is just horrid. I probably wouldn't recommend uh, the Slasher as a solo PvP ship. Maybe for uh, Interceptor, you know, getting up close and warp jamming somebody. And um, maybe speed tanking from a distance, but you're really not doing much damage at a distance past like four kilometers. Um, Yeah, this thing really flies. We see we are, uh, without just slight velocity uh, boosting rig I put on there, we're already at 2100 just about. So we were really flying, but uh, the style of PK is just not reasonable. I had the same problem with my Condor and the small torpedo launchers. Um, sometimes I just couldn't get the orbit right and it would just kind of go a kilometer out of range sometimes and I'd miss a hit or two. Um, when you get webbed you're just completely boned. You'd have to out DPS somebody pretty much um, or just try to get outside the web, come back in and hopefully they don't web you. So I think I'm going to take the small auto cannon off. Um, I will definitely die, especially with my ballistic control system, so I'll put the shield booster and my small missiles, and we'll see if we can find somebody to kill. Alright, so I got myself refit with my small missile launcher, my shield booster, my uh, interruptive warp disruptor, and my interruptive stasis web of fire. Optimally, I want to orbit around 12 kilometers so I can web them and they can't web me. Um, we are getting substantially less DPS on this ship with missiles um, just due to the uh, the ship spec for small cannons pretty much, which uh, I don't think are the best. If we go into, uh, let's see, market. Let's just check a Condor out. Has the same thing, but with missile specs. It's just a slightly slower ship. This one really just outdoes the uh, velocity on my Condor. But when we go into Condor 2, and we open this up, you can see uh, per frigate command bonus level, you get a 12% uh 
small missile torpedo damage. So if that's maxed, that's uh, what, 58% more damage. So you'll see I'm hitting for 500s in my Condor, I'd be hitting for 1100s or more. Um, let's just warp around here. I will come back when I find somebody. All right, here we go. Let's see if we can find somebody. Found a few uh, tier five anomalies here. Nobody home. The uh, sheer velocity on this thing is just great. Just immediately you can, it stops, you can warp. You're just flying around space, just faster in all hell. Yeah, looks like we found our uh, old friend Slay he Slay Hill here. He has me marked as blue. Thank God he would. Uh, yeah, thank God he doesn't have me marked as red. He would slap me up a new one. Let's, uh, let's get out of here before he changes his mind. This guy is a, an absolute beast. Do not mess with this guy if you see him. Alright, let's move on. Looks like I found somebody. Let's see if I can catch him here. Okay. Let's see if we, oh, shoot. I turned my afterburner off. Let's get him webbed up. Oh no. Really? Fuck! Fucking A. Completely unscathed. Ah. Cool, we killed him. Completely AFK, we killed him. I don't remember where we were. I think it may have been this one. Well, we killed a Condor 2 with a slasher um, <laughs> with small missile launchers somehow. And I got disconnected. Oh, our loot's still there. Thank goodness. Let us go loot this. 
So the reason why I got within 12 kilometers was to web him so he could not escape. Um, cool. Public fleet there. And we got webbed again. Let's just head to this next one here at 30. Let's see. Yeah, it's not bad loot at all. A little over a mil. Smuggler's afterburner. I will take it. Let's see if we can find anybody else here. item we did not get. There's a lot of people over here. Look at all these guys. Some maulers, a thorax. Hmm. Shoot. Let's see what happens here. I'm going to orbit this guy at 20. There are four of them here, so let's uh, let's keep our distance. Uh-oh, they have me scrambled now. They are doing no damage on me. I'm not sure if the drones... Yep, the drones are hitting me. Not for much, though. They must be smalls. Now, if I get webbed, I am completely screwed. Let's just slowly but surely whittle this guy down. What is that thing? That must just be the drone. Oh, that's a mauler. Now, if he gets close enough, I will web him. Looks like they are all leaving. <laughs> they all just left his poor friend. Oh, this poor guy's left for dead. Wonder what they're gonna do. They might be regearing in condors or something. It's gonna be a long, stupid fight. Oh, he got me. Yeah. Well, let's just take out his hammerhead here. It's 
like they're coming back in to try to save him. start whittling this guy away here. This is going to be kind of a silly fight, but probably get out of here soon. Trying to web me. They are doing everything they can to save their poor friend. One more shot and she should be down. One more shot. They had me webbed for a sec. Got him. And he's out of here. Alright. That was a long, drawn-out fight. Let's uh, just warp out of here and uh, check our bounty. Yeah, he didn't have pretty much anything. He had railgun rigs. 400k in about half an hour. I'd say that is a good kill. Um, let's just go ahead and check the last medium and we'll get out of here. Got my hands on a Catalyst 2 here. See if anybody comes to save him. Let's go ahead and orbit at 19 so we don't lose him. Actually, let's try going in a little bit. Not sure what weapons he's using there. Seems to be doing less DPS now.
And we got them. Let's go ahead and check the loot. Turn our shield booster off and get out of here. So whatever type of weapon that was, he was having trouble uh, hitting me. Some type of laser. I'll have to look at the kilometer range on there. Oof. That is some juicy loot. Thank you, my friend. Let's get out of here. Shield boost back up. And we pretty much insta warp. And we are safe. I'll probably check some more anomalies in just a moment here. Let's check our kill report. Kaldari Navy Small Rifled. Okay. Damage control, small shield booster. Yeah, we got some pretty juicy loot from this guy. Oh, we got two of these puppies on him. Wow. That was some good money right there. Now, just for heaven's sake, let's see. Let's check his weapons out. Okay, so he has a 9 kilometer range with a 5 kilometer accuracy fall off. Now he was doing quite a bit of damage to me at 20 kilometers, so I'm not sure if he had some specialization in there to shoot farther or uh, what's going on with that. Yeah, he had no range extender. Huh, interesting. Yeah, we were able to take him out um, with a slasher 2 and small missiles. Our velocity bonus uh, did definitely help. Um, we would have killed him twice as fast and probably not had to worry about barely even shield boosting if we, uh, if we had my Condor. But uh, yeah, it's not a bad trade-off. Uh, let's check a few other places. Alright, looks like we got a can you here. I don't think he notices me yet. And we got him warp jammed. I'm gonna go nice and close to this gentleman. I think this is going to be a long drawn out fight and hopefully the rats don't uh, web me here. Yeah, I'm barely doing any DPS to them. The rats are going to get right up on top of me. to lose our web of fire on him. What is that green stuff coming off? Is that a... Does he have four Nosferatus? I don't even know what that green, green line is there. We'll slowly but surely whittle Hunter 99 Raphael away. It's going to be another long one, so uh, I'll probably cut it out until he's down to hole or something. Just gonna 
zoom out and wait this one out. I think I'm going to go make some lunch. Um, I think I'm going to go to the bathroom. I'm going to clean my room, maybe do some laundry. And then I'll uh, check back in uh, 15, 20 minutes. This guy's capacitor can't really uh, handle this. Um, looks like he has an armor and a shield repair. But those can use without a pretty high engineering. Really just don't have much capacitor. He'll probably repair for a little bit and uh, run out of juice. So let's keep waiting. Well, you can see just the sheer DPS, um, actually not DPS, velocity here, he can't even touch me. He probably just has a small drone shooting me or something, he's doing just 
10-15 damage per second, but one shield boost tick just completely clears that out. And the can you bites the dust. Let's just loot him up here. Wow, there's a lot of loot on the ground. I think I might swoop around and just check it out. Let's check. Yeah, I'm glad it didn't give me my kill report to see what I didn't get. Mark 7, medium rapid. Returned, returned. Yeah, not, not the best loot. Well, this was kind of an odd video. Um, I put small missile launchers on a ship that uh, isn't specified to take small missile launchers. They seem to work just fine. Um, I tried to um, compensate the lower DPS with a higher velocity. Um, the ship is extremely quick. I've heard of people getting up to the 22, 2400. Um, with better uh, afterburners, better rigs, and uh, higher skills. So the 2400 range is pretty darn fast. Um, I think I'd prefer the DPS of my Condor going a little bit slower um, over what this is built for. I was able to kill some people. Um, I was able to kill a Condor too. Um, but overall, uh, I think I'm going to stick with a missile specified over the extra velocity. Um, but alright guys, I'll see you on the next one. Peace.